Hi there. This is gonna be a little bit of a different video and a little bit of different format. It's gonna be a little bit longer than my usual YouTube content, so bear with me. It's worth it, trust me. What I'm about to show you is not a war on release, it is an open beta. We haven't done an open beta in war on community in a long time, way before war on two days. And parts of this will be incorporated into a 2.3 war on release coming later next year. But it was too good to keep to ourselves. And honestly, I'm super excited about this. But before I unwrap this, um, I wanna remind you to stick around after the reveal video. I wanna talk about this a little bit and there's a couple of announcements I wanna make. So without further ado, I present to you Voron Afterburner. Huh? You excited? I am. So let's talk about this. We have new tool head. We have dual rails on the X. We have new XY joints to go with those dual rails. We have a universal chain mounting system and we have a new spool holder. Oh yeah, and there's a direct drive extruder on that thing. So first of all, the print head. It is now just a couple of pieces of plastic wrapped around a hot end. And that's really all you need to print to have swappable tool heads. Um, it doesn't have any fans mounted to it. It's literally just a hot end. So inside the extruder body, you'll find the guts of a BMG extruder. It's a very good extruder and it's very popular and therefore it's been cloned a whole bunch. So your pricing options vary widely. So the extruder gear sits a little bit lower on the afterburner than it does on original BMG. And the filament path is centered. And all of that was because of the packaging on the X carriage itself. Um, I wanted the motor to sit as close to the belt as possible to minimize any of the negative effects that we have by, of strapping a NEMA 17 motor to the X carriage. And it also has a filament release latch because that's kind of what we do in War on Land. So the cooling is not provided by two fans. There's a 40 by 20 millimeter fan sitting on top, provides par cooling, that's important for PLA, as well as a 40 by 10 millimeter fan providing cooling for the hot end. And because the printhead is so open, even the smaller fan that we're currently using on 2.2 .2 can uh, 
can provide plenty of cooling for the hot end to prevent any kind of jams that you might have while printing PLA. And why I keep saying PLA is because there's a myth that Voron is an ABS machine only. You will only print ABS. Yes, Voron can print ABS, but it prints PLA quite nicely, especially with this upgrade. Just leave the door open. So the X-axis now has two MGN rails, and the main purpose is stability and rigidity. Uh, when, you when you toss a NEMA 17 motor on top of the X carriage, you really want this thing to be completely solid. Because of this, there are new X XY joints, and I took the opportunity to make them a little more rigid. We are going back to a two-piece design that we used on 2.1, simply because the three-piece design that's currently used on 2.2 is not quite as rigid as I figured out. And you really don't find these things until you strap a heavy weight to your X and throw it around a whole bunch. So another thing that people have been asking for are drag chain mounts. And Afterburner includes a unified system that allows you to choose between using zip chains, which are a good budget-friendly option because it's printed, um, to using uh, drag chains from AliExpress all the way to using IGUS drag chains, which are fantastic. Lastly, I would acknowledge the fact that there is a direct drive extruder mod for Voron 2 that was community created, and that modification was Trailblazer for Afterburner. So thank you. Without you, we wouldn't have it. And that's it. Um, there are a few other odds and ends that um, I'll let you guys discover yourself when you dig into it. And uh, tomorrow, please tune in to Voron Live at 11 o'clock Pacific for a Q&A on this thing and also a very special announcement about the filament used in this video. Thank you for watching. And I just would like to take this opportunity to wish you Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays, and Happy New Year from all of us at Voron Design. Take care, guys.